starting out with calibrating of the header. This is a foldable corn head. This is a set we're in a S780 combine with a Gen 4 display. Going to hit our main menu button. We're going to hit our calibration button. For a header, we're going to hit our header calibration. And there's several things that we're going to calibrate. One of the things is our deck plate spacing. We click that. Going through here, it will tell us what it's looking for and what, us, what it wants us to do next. We're going to hit our calibrate. It's going to say combine to field mode, which we're in field mode. Engine at high idle. We set it to high idle. And then it asks us uh, to flow our deck plate commands. We're going to hit start. It's going to ask us to verify that our wings are fully unfolded. And when they are fully unfolded, we're going to hit next. And if the wings were not fully unfolded, it, that display would come up saying wings are not unfolded. So it would not let us proceed if they were not unfolded. Now the calibrate will continue automatically. I press and hold our deck plate close button, which is right here. Our deck plates are closing, and I keep them, the button held. And now when it says open, I'm going to push the deck plate open button, and it's going to ask me to hold. And when it's successful, it'll come up with a calibration complete page. If it's not successful, it'll have an error code. One of the other calibrations we're going to want to do to make sure it's going to work good going through the field is our header calibration. And it's going to want us to calibrate. It's going to ask us for all these features, engine running high idle, uh, lower feeder house, uh, what it's going to do is raise feeder house and then confirm settings. So we just going to hit start. Make sure our wings are fully unfolded, which they are. We're going to level our feeder house tilt. That's going to be the button on the back of the, the handle. When our feeder house tilt is level, it's going to prompt us to continue lower feeder house to the ground. And then we'll hit next. Press and hold feeder house raise. Once that is completed successful, we're going to hit save. Next, it's going to want us to tune our auto header height, the AHC. We're going to hit next. And it's going to say press and hold the lower switch. At this, in this calibration, your header will bounce up and down as it tunes the sensors. When the calibration is complete, we save it, and that completes the header calibration. Now we're going to do the feeder house, or with the folding corn head, we're going to want to go through our folding tilt, or our folding uh, calibration. going to tell us an overview. It says press our deck plate button to run our folding corn or our folding wings. I'm just going to verify that they were fully unfolded. 
On the S600 series combines, this is a very slow process. They've changed some things on the S700 series to make this faster. Once it's fully, unfolded, fully folded, we will hit next and it'll tell us to fully unfold our wings using our deck plate folding button. When it's fully unfolded, we're going to hit next. And if there was a sensor not reading correctly, it will give us a fault code and it won't show us complete. Since we're complete, we're all set. We're going to exit out of this. And we're going to check to make sure our header is working properly. So we're going to leave our separator off. We're going to turn our header on and we're gonna hit our number one button. That's gonna get us to our high set point. If you wanna adjust the height, there's a knob that has AHC bond, uh, labeled for it. Turn that knob and that will adjust your number one set height. If you hit our number two, that's going to be our infield position. And you can also use the AHC knob to adjust our height. And when it's down in the position you want, to make sure the centers are reading correctly, tilt your header to the left, and the header should go up along with the feeder house. And when you let go of the button, it should go back level. You should angle it to the right. The same thing should happen. And you let go, it should level itself out. If it does not, then we probably have either a malfunctioning sensor or a stuck rod, sensing rod. Number three is another preset for a different height that you can adjust. You can adjust that to be lower than two or higher than two, whatever your preference.